We're rolling out some changes to Fetch, making it easier than ever for you to find and enjoy great entertainment. This video gives you an overview of what's changing in the TV Guide. There's an updated design and loads of new features intended to make it easier to use and to give you easy access to more content. To access the TV Guide, press the TV Guide button on your Fetch remote. You will notice a new design with larger text and a darker colour scheme making things easier to see. We've also expanded the screen space to feature a full screen channel list. Program information will no longer appear at the top of the screen, but instead will dynamically follow you in the TV guide and appear when you pause on a show in the channel list. This gives you easy contextual access to show information, making it easier to choose. What we used to call shortcuts are now called actions. You can view the actions menu available in the TV guide screen by pressing the blue button on your fetch remote. This will bring up handy reminders of the TV guide functions. The My Channels tab has been replaced by Favourite Channels. Your favourite channels will appear at the top of your channel list so you can quickly see what's playing on the channels you watch most. To create a favourite channel, press the yellow button on your Fetch remote when the channel is highlighted in the channel list. You can favourite as many channels as you like and they will automatically appear at the top of your channel list. You can remove them by highlighting the channel and pressing the yellow button on your Fetch remote again. The yellow bar next to the channel number tells you a channel is on your favourites list. You can move between your favourite channels by pressing the silver arrow keys on your remote. Your favourite channels will be separated from the rest of the channel list with a new promotional row. This will showcase the best new content and make it easier than ever for you to find out about the latest new shows. The new Fetch TV guide lets you access your channels faster. Pressing PAW will now launch the highlighted channel straight away. You can then use the green button to watch from the start if you'd like to. In the TV guide, you can still bring up the program options menu. To do this, highlight a show and press the info button on your remote. Here you can find classification information and closed caption availability. From this screen, you can also select watch to launch the channel or watch from start to watch the current program from the beginning. You can also start recording the episode to watch later or set up a series recording to automatically record every episode. Programs with series recordings available will have this icon. This replaces the series tag star that you are used to seeing. You can see which programs have recordings and series recordings set up from the main channel list screen, as they'll have the icon displayed in the bottom right-hand corner. If you missed your favourite show, you can now go backwards through the TV guide and catch up on things you missed today or in the past 24 hours. To do this, press the left arrow on your Fetch remote while a channel is highlighted and move backwards through the TV guide. The channel logos will move to the right-hand side of the screen when you are looking at titles that have already aired. The shows written in white with the play icon in the top right corner are available to be watched now in catch-up. When the show name is written in grey, it means we don't have access to an on-demand asset and unfortunately they can't be watched. But you can still select these to set a recording if you have a Fetch Mighty. To watch a show, simply select it to start watching. You will need to be signed into the free TV apps to watch free-to-air shows. You can do this in the TV catch-up area. To go back to real-time viewing, just use your right arrow until you see the channel logos back on the left-hand side of your screen. So that's an overview of the main changes we've made to the TV Guide. It might take you a short while to get used to the new look and functions, but once you do, the intention is to make finding your favourite channels and shows easier than ever. If you need any more information on how to use Fetch, please refer to the User Guide at fetch.com.au forward slash guides.